Okay, good evening. We're up to uh, Yud Dalit on the base of the Mishnah, and we're continuing, uh, continuing the din of Hatfasa. Hatfasa, going ahead and taking another, comparing it to something in order to create Issa. So yesterday we saw that you can only have to go ahead and be mafis in a Dava Hanada. You can't go ahead right and be mafsit, mafis in Rim Sech to Kudu Yeah, I know you're still in Kasuas. And it's so, uh, yeah, it's it's a uh, Nataran. <laughs> okay, anyway, so uh, so we said you have to be mafis in a Dava Hanada, not a Dava Rasa, therefore you're mafis in a Basel Chazir, it doesn't work. Uh, we spoke about uh, comparing it that when Shayla, if you could do it, compare it to your mother, Tashmish to your your wife to your mother. We said that's uh, an Amaaretz, you, you require you, you require Shayla. So basically, we're continuing this the sugya of of Atfasa. We're continuing the sugya of, of Atfasa. So we welcome everybody live and living color <laughs> and on the Zoom. Quite a few people this evening. One second. Okay. Now this Mishnah is ambiguous. Well, the Mishnah is we're going to combine two Mishnayas, and this Mishnah is going to be ex explained by a Machloikis Amaroyim, and we're going to ask one of these Amaroyim. And through the process of asking on that Amaira, we're going to go to get clarity exactly what the case of the Mishnah is. So the Mishnah says the following on Yud Dalin on base Konim Sha'ani Yashon. It's a carbon that I sleep. I'm attaching the words. Shani uh, medaber. It's a carbon that I speak. Shani mehalach that I walk. It's koinim that my my tashpish on you are is there. So all these cases, you are there's a nether, and if you open the nether, you're chay for by yachal devar. We have no idea what this mission means. Zero, zero, zero. This again. Again, whatever it sounds like, it's good, but there's no clarity here whatsoever. Zero Does, doesn't mean anything. Doesn't mean anything. Now, the next Mishnah is a Shvua. If you look at the next Mishnah, fellas, on Tesvav Amidays, the next Mishnah on Tesvav Amidays, the same, the same Mishnah, and Heshi, you'll see that, that uh, you sit corrected because it says over here, Shvua She'eni Yashan, Shvua that I will not sleep, She'eni Medaber, I will not speak, She'eni Mahalich, Asr. So notice the same context, the same context, sleeping, speaking, walking, the difference in, in the context being, right? One is a shvur, one's a neder. Also notice the lashon of sha'ani by neder and the lashon she'ani by shvur. Also the lashon by neder of layachal devaro and by shvur the lashon of aser. So we just co contrasted the two. We contrasted in the fact sha'ani, which means my sleep, meaning it's not going on myself, it's going on the sleep. But neither goes on the chetza. It goes on, so it's going on sleep, it's going on walking, it's going on talking. Whereas Shani, it's going on my, I'm talking, I'm sleeping. A shvu is on the gavra. So when it goes on the nether, it's Shani, my particular thing, but not me, but the thing itself. Sha'ini, I won't sleep, I won't talk, I won't walk. And that's the, the difference in Shani and Sha'ini. And the second difference, which will become clear in the Gemara, is why by you say by Neda Layachal Devaro, like by Neda we say the Lashan Layachal Devaro, and by Shvu we say Asa. We say there Layachal Devaro, and by Shvu we, we simply say it's Asa. So exactly that will become clear. These are all Ha'aris from the Ran, and there's Hashem in the Gemara. It'll, it'll become clear. Okay? So, says the Gemara, Itmar. Kainim enai b'shena hayoyim in ishon lemacha. It's, it's kainim, my eyes to sleep today. That's a nether, guys. Good. However, this nether is contingent upon a tenai. What's the tenai? In ishon lemacha. So, here's the deal. This nether is only a nether if the Tanai is engaged. What's the Tanai? If I, it's, it's on Sunday. You say, I make a nether, I won't sleep, or my eyes will not close on Sunday. If I sleep on Monday. Good. What happens if you don't sleep on Monday? Okay, goes into high. You can sleep the whole Sunday very, very good. You don't have a nether. The nether only is engaged if, uh, if you go ahead and sleep on 
Monday. Good. So you have the neder, the iser, before the tonight. Can you sleep on Sunday? That's the question. Can you sleep on Sunday? Now, if you sleep on Sunday, and now you better not sleep on Monday, correct? So that's the question. Can you sleep on Sunday? On, and we're not worried about you sleeping on Monday? Or no, you cannot sleep on Sunday because you might have to sleep on Monday. So that's a Tanai. We, we haven't been exposed to this yet in the Masechta. Uh, a Neder on a Tanai. But the Tanai is taking place at a later point. And therefore, can you, can you take the chance? Take the chance of sleeping on Sunday lest you sleep on Monday. Says Rav Nachman, you could. Says Rav Huda, in the name of Rav, you can't. Says Rav Nachman, you can't. Says the Gemara, it my coin the bishin ayoyim and mishon lamachar, um Rav Yudah marav, al yishon ayoyim. Don't sleep on Sunday. Shem a yishon lamachar. Maybe you can sleep on Monday. Rav Nachman, um, no. Yishon ayoyim, shluf isn't the height. Sleep Monday, Sunday. Well, but like Hashin and Shem a yishon lamachar, we're not worried that you're going to sleep on Monday. Good. That, that's the so the, the point of focus is Rabbi Yehuda. The whole Gemara will focus on Rabbi Yehuda. What about the following guys? I say if I another koinim einoy on Monday, if I sleep on Sunday, you switch the order. Koinim einoy on Monday, it's us of me to sleep on Monday, if I sleep on Sunday. So in this case, guys, the Tanai is coming before the Neda. Then Rabbi Yehuda is going to be Maida that you could do it. What's the difference? The difference is, what do you have to keep? In the first scenario, you have to keep the, the, the Tanai to engage the Neda. In the second, the second scenario, you have to go ahead and engage the Neda, this or itself. The clock is ticking because you did the Tanai, you slept. So it says, Umayda Rabbi Yehuda, and Rabbi Yehuda is Maida. <laughs> My eyes are kind of to sleep on Monday. If I sleep on, on Sunday, you can sleep on Sunday. What's the chilek, fellas? What's the difference? Again, when the Neda comes first and the Tanaya second, says Rabbi Yehuda, no, you, can't sleep, you can't sleep on Sunday. When the, ne- the Tanaya is first and the Neda is next, you can sleep on Sunday. What's the chilek, says the, the Gemara? Kiloi mizdahir bitanoi. When will a person not be so careful when it comes to a condition? When it comes to an iser, misdaher. He will go ahead, what? And he'll be very, very careful. When it comes to an isa, he will be what? He will be, in fact, very careful. So when the Tanai is on Sunday and the iser is on Monday, sleep on Sunday. You know why? Since it's the nether itself on Monday, you're going to be very careful. Conversely, if the nether was on Sunday and the Tonight was on Monday. We were so careful in the tonight, and therefore we won't let, won't let you sleep on on Sunday. That's the chilek between the two. That's the chilek between the two. Guys, you good? Any questions? Well, everyone's good. Yeah, good. very good. Okay, says the Gemara Vaita again. So very important. The shita of of Rabbi Rabbi Huda. The shita of Rabbi Huda. Rabbi Huda says a person will be careful when it comes to the issa. He will not be careful when it comes to the tonight. So like Rabbi Yehuda, we won't let you sleep on Sunday lest you sleep on Monday. Good. Now, so what do you see from him? Now, what is, what is this not sleeping? Exactly. What exactly? So here's what we're going to do. We're going to take our Mishnah. We're going to go ahead in our Mishnah, which was cryptic. Go ahead and apply it and ask a question of Rabbi Yehuda. And in the evolution of that question, you can say evolution. Right? In the evolution of that question, we're going to get a clarity as to what our mission is talking about. Good? <clears throat> says, says the Gemara. Right. Koinim sha'ani yashon. Sha'ani mahalak, sha'ani medabra. I'm Mishnah. I'm Mishnah. It's koinim, that that I sleep, that that I walk, <laughs> that that, it, what, that I, I talk. Now, hechi dami. Now, yesterday we saw, what's the chumrah? What, what's the chumrah of, of um, actually we saw it two, two days ago. What's the chumrah of a shvua over a nether? A shvua can be chal on davar she'ein by mamish, and a neder can't. A shvua can't be chal on a mitzvah, and a neder could. The Rami spoke out beautifully. Why can a shvua be chal on on a on a, on a davar she'yesh by mamish? Because even if the you make a shvua not to not to sleep, good. The sleep is is is, is, is not. There's no mamasha to sleep, but it's a good shvua. Why? 
because it's on you and, and you're a mamish. A shmuz is a gavra and you have mamashes. Whereas a nether is on the chefza, on the object. So if you don't have an object, you don't have, you don't have a nether. Good? So now, what are you saying? What is Hamishta saying? Koinim, my sleep is koinim. Koinim is the lashon of a nether. It's also like a carbon. What are you answering? You sleep. What's the problem? Sleep is not a double for mamish. So that can't be shot in the Mishnah, right? The Mishnah spoke about three things that ain't by mamish, right? It spoke about sleeping, it spoke about talking, and it spoke about walking, and it spoke about passion. Hey, Chidam. Elaymikidiktani, mamish literally. Shani yashon, that it means that what? It's kind of my sleep. Me having nudge, is that a neda? Vatanya, it's a Bryce, not a Mishnah, guys. Vatanya. Koyme bishvuas, chashvuah chala al dovashesh by mamish, al dovashesh by mamish, as we just spoke out. Mashen ke bin adarim. Vishen a dovashesh by mamishu. And sleep is something that does not have any tangibility to it. So it can't be that you're taking what? The Mishnah literally? It can't be taken literally. Ella, it must be. The Omar, Kainim Enai Vishenai. Oh, I'm saying my eyes are Kainim for sleep. So, in other words, how am I accomplishing the Mishnah, the Isra of sleep? <laughs> Through a Dabashesh for Mamish, which is, is your eyes. The Dabashesh for Mamish. So, that, so, so, we added words to the Mishnah. When the word I Mishnah mentioned no words about eyes, but Al you have to say it's speaking about eyes. Why? Why is it speaking about eyes? It does not for the blog, of course, but why is it speaking about eyes? It's speaking because of it needs a mamashis for Veneda, right? It needs a mamash for Veneda. The idol of Shiura. Now, how long, how long are you saying my eyes should not coin my eyes for sleep? What does that mean? So let's get, give you a share. Next case. In other words, we we still, it's not enough to shot in the Mishnah. It's not enough to say my eyes are calling them to sleep. Why? How long, how long does that mean? Forever? You can't, you can't possibly stay up forever. It says the Gemara, the, the e, if it's speaking, the E, the Layav Shiura, Mishav Kinale, at the Ova of Isabel Yachel. Guys, this is, guys, he says the following My eyes, kind of my eyes in sleep. Good, the works, works, yeah. Your eyes works, yeah. He's gonna be open by Yachel immediately. He's gonna be us immediately. If a person says a shvua that I won't sleep for three days, Malkin I say be You know what you know what you have to do, guys? You give Malkus right away. Why? So what 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 are you over? Shvua shav. You're not over by Yachel. You aren't over Yachel. You're over Shvua Shav. When something can't be done, ah, so yeah, the shvur doesn't take effect until, until right away. No, shvur shav right. No, boyachel no, doesn't take effect until three days later. Shvur shav right away. You Malkin miyad. You get laalta. You give malchus. Ah, so what's the tushdel to us? Well, we're speaking around the darim guys, right? I said, go back to the amid base, the bottom line in the in, in the ran. Amid base, bottom line in the ran. Okay. You go ahead and give Malchus immediately. Even though by neder, it's not possible to make a neder shav. The neder shav, because shua we said this lashon. In other words, even though it's not a neder shav, but again, the con that's the concept. That in other words, so we've established what. Watch. We're establishing two parameters to the Mishnah. One, when you say koinim sleep, it means your eyes. And two, it has to be within a certain amount of time that's normal, that it's possible for a person to stay up. Or else it's, wide, it's, net, it's, it, you're, it's right over right away. Okay, so now. Ella must be, the Amar koinim ena b'sheni l'machar. You say the shvur shvichal on a Monday. Em ishin ayam if I sleep on Sunday. So we fit in very clandestinely that what this is our Mishnah, where he said the Tanai for a Monday, uh, the Shmuel for a Monday, and the Tanai for a Sunday, right? Fred the Gemara, that can't be our Mishnah. Ha'amit kol bi'isura mizdaher, and that 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 would work, right? Because you're going to keep Monday because that's your nether. The Tanai is on Sunday. The nether is on Monday. El pshite must be the Amar. It must be where a person says, 
koinim einam b'shin ayoyim, meaning the tenai is made on what? Uh, the tenai, the nether is made on a Sunday. Im isha l'machar, right? If I sleep what? Okay, so guys, we just created the shot in the Mishnah. Let's go back to our Mishnah now. Guys, let's go back to the Mishnah on Yudal and Medveis. A beautiful Gemara of how you built up something unbelievable. Guys, watch. Here's the, here's the way you can read the Mishnah. Koinam einai im yashan hayayim. What? And what's the shear? If I sleep tomorrow. That's the case of the Mishnah. Koinam, those three words. Koinam shani yashan means koinam my eyes. If I sleep on 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 Sunday, if if on a tonight that I don't sleep on Monday, that's our mission. That's everybody. It's everybody. That's our mission. Now, why does it say you over on Balyachel Debare? Good. That means the the neda is chal. Good. How is the only way for this neda to be chal, guys? The neda means that I slept on, I slept on Monday, right? But for the neda to be slept on Monday, I would have had to what? Slept on Sunday. But according to Rabbi Yehuda, we don't let you sleep on Sunday. That's the kasha. One more time. So come on, let's go. Give all the good build up, guys. We know to, we know things. We know the Mishnah. Whatever the case of the Mishnah is, guys, you're over by look at me. Whatever the case of the Mishnah is, you're over on by Yachal Devare. Whatever it is. Good. What is? We just figured out what is. Hey, it's got to be speaking about your eyes because you need a double shape of Amish. It's got to be speaking about a time limit, right? Now, the easiest time limit would have been to say, coin them if I sleep today. You know, we're giving on it tonight. You should have asked me a question. Why did you throw it tonight in there? Why all of a sudden, punk, did you throw it tonight on Monday, right? Why did you throw it tonight in? Says the Ran, because it would be a double portion. If, if I sleep today, in other words, in the Dorim, you're telling me a case, there's got to be a Kiddush over there. So if you're telling me that's not a case, there's no Kiddush. The Kiddush over here is, What's the Kiddush? That even though it's contingent upon it tonight, you still can't sleep on what? On Sunday. All right. So that's our case. Your nether is on a Sunday. Your tonight is on a Monday. And it says you're over by Yachel Devarai. So let's fill in the blanks, guys. Let's fill in the blanks. You slept on Monday, correct? Meaning you're over on by Yachel. But in order for it to be a nether, you would have had to go ahead and be over on tonight on Sunday. But Rabbi Yudha says what? You can't. That's the question. Let's see it inside. El Pshita, what's it talking about? The Amar, Koinim Einai Vishena Hayoim on a Sunday. And that's the that's the nether. And what's the Tanai? In Ishan Lamachar, if I sleep on Monday. The Eloi Nayim Hayoim. And if you don't sleep on a Sunday, right? Kinayim Lamachar, my Bal Yachel, the Vore Ika. If you sleep on sun, on Monday, what Bal Yachel is there? So it must be that what that you that what that you slept on. So we see let you we let you sleep. Who's that? That's Rebbe Nachman, not Rebbe Huda. Good, that's the kash. El Olav, it must be be denayim alma is your denayim the tiyuf the Rebbe Huda that you could sleep on on on. We let you sleep, and it's an upshlag on Rebbe Huda. And for the Gemara, he ketani the inayim. The mission is speaking yeah. if you sleep. Okay? Meaning. So what's the bayachel then? Guys, bayachel is mashmah, you're over on an isla, correct? If you sleep, you're over on an isla. What does that mean? So let's see the run over here. Let's see the run. El alav b'denayim, alma isya denayim. It's about parallel gemara, about eight lines down to gemara parallel. El alav b'denayim, alma isya denayim. Umas nisa and hakamashman. Here's the Kiddush Ram Mishnah. Hareizeh b'balyachel devaroi kloimah. What is... What's the Balyachel guy? If Kloimar, Hareze, Muta, Lavoy, Lede, Suffolk, Balyachel, will let you sleep on a Sunday that you come to the Suffolk of Balyachel by being sleeping on Monday. Shemratz, Elisha, and Biyar Misha, and go ahead. Layamin and Layisha, we don't say don't sleep. Kadesh, Layay, Efshalai, Lavoy, Lede, Balyachel. Okay, that's enough. Now, that's, that, that's the case. So, Light Reb Yehud, Light Reb Nachman, we're not worried. Light Reb Yehud, though, we are worried. Let Rabbi Yehuda are worried. So let Rabbi Yehuda. So that's the case of the Mishnah. Okay. So now, so what happened? You went ahead and you slept. So let's look at the Ran, the last line where it's thin, the last thin line. The Tiyuf the Rabbi Yehuda. Kikitani, when is the Mishnah speaking? The Enayim. 
if you slept. But Adar Rabba, Masli son Hoda Rav Yehuda, it's a it's what a slash minon. It's a riot to Rav Yehuda. Vahachi Tani, Ye Zohar, be careful. Shall I Yishan Yom Rishon? Be careful. You don't sleep on a Sunday to put the nether in motion. Yashan, because if you sleep on a Sunday. Because you're not going to keep your tenai on Monday. So that, that's Adarabba. A Mishnah is a raya. When it says, you know what it means? Don't sleep on Sunday. Because you may come to sleep on Monday. Monday is tonight. And a person's not so careful about it tonight. So the Mishnah, if anything, is a riot of Yehuda and not a Kashan of Yehuda. Guys, good? Okay, well, that's, it's, very, it's very good. I'll say it over one more time quickly. We have Machlokas, guys, look, look at me quickly. Machlokas between Rabbi Yehuda and Rabbi Nachman. A person goes ahead and says, what? I'm going to go ahead. I make a neda that I won't sleep today if I sleep tomorrow. Good. Make a neda. I can't sleep today if I sleep tomorrow. If you don't sleep tomorrow, everything is great. So now, you won't know what's going to be today until you figure out the tomorrow, right? So will we let you sleep today? Chas Vashon, you may come to sleep tomorrow, says Rabbi Nachman, no problem. A person, he'll be careful. And we, you're not worried about it, kind of suffered by Yacha. Says Rabbi Yehuda, the rabbi. No, we won't let you do it because you may come to be. So we may let you do it. We're, we're, now we then proved from our Mishnah uh, and we built up our Mishnah that exactly the Mishnah is the case where Rav Nachman and Rabbi Yehuda argue, and we asked the question of Rabbi Yehuda. Rabbi Yehuda says, "Our Mishnah is speaking lo yachal. If you fall asleep on Sunday, then you got a problem because you may come to see money. So therefore, it's a riot to Rabbi Yehuda, and that's where we're holding." Ravina gives a different text. Ravina says it's speaking. Forget about your eyes, guys. Forget about your eyes. It's speaking where mamish literally. You make a nether kainim. What's the kainim that you won't sleep? Kainim that you won't sleep. And forget I. I need a davar sheish for mamish. But yachal here is the rabbanan. But yachal here is the rabbanan. Ravina ama loylem kiditani. Loylem is like we spoke. It's speaking about what where you don't have eyes, and it's speaking about not You know, you have eyes, but the shvu is on on sleep. I it's a davar sheish for mamish sleep. Or my bal yachal with the rabbanan. When it says Malyachal, it's, it's Midrabanan. Fred the Gemara, me Yikal Balyachal, but the Rabbanan is such an animal called ba- Balyachal, the Rabbanan. It says we're in, there sure is. But Tanya, what's the Raya? The Baram, Mutarim, Bacherim, Nogma, Isser, Iyatu, Shayla, Tirim, if Nahem. It's something that people know is Mutter. You know it's Mutter. You know it's Mutter. Dachim is a toysvis in the Psachim, right? That, that you know it's Mutter. And people are Noig Isser, you can't be Noig head kept in front of them, right? But you can't be no cat in front of them. Shinema la yachel devaray. It says la yachel devaray, and that's that's the, that's the idrabana. Okay, okay, guys. We just finished the pshat in the mishnah. Now we're going to just delve into the machloekas between Rabbi Yehuda and Rabbi uh, 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 Nachman. But we're only going to ask on Rabbi Yehuda. We're going to question Rabbi Yehuda constantly. We're going to barrage him. Okay. So now, in order to do this, just one. Always keep in mind, like Rabbi Yehuda, the Tanai comes before the neder. The tonight, so our tonight is what is sleep. Our tonight is sleep, and our nether is sleep. Good. We're gonna have other gemaras. I'll sushtel them back, and you'll see the kasha. I don't know. No, I don't have one. Okay, now tonight, a man says the following to his wife: "Shat nenesli at a pesach." He's standing. It's between sukkahs and pesach, guys. Guys, I have to help up for this case. He's standing between sukkahs and pesach. Good. And he says the following, you can't have enough from me until Pesach. That's a nether, guys. That's, I won't sleep on Sunday. That's the same thing. I won't sleep on Sunday. You can't have, a me- have enough from me in Pesach. In Telchi Lebeis Avicha, if you go to your father's house, at a chag until Sukkot. So what, this is the case of the nether. You, you can't have enough before the Tanai. You can't go to daddy's house. That's the same as our case, what? The same is our case. You can't sleep on Sunday lest you go ahead right and sleep on Monday. Good. So now, let's say she goes, she goes home. She goes Pesach. In other words, she engaged the Tanai, Asura, out of Pesach. She went to daddy's house. So she did the Tanai. This is easy. She was over the Tanai. Once she was over the Tanai, then what? Then the nether is enforced. And then she won't be able to have enough from her husband until Pesach. Again, the net once she goes before the once she's over on the tanai within the parameters of the of the nether, then so she engaged the nether. The nether is you won't have enough till Pesach. Very easily, that's it. 
Oh. Pesach, Asura. Dafka, if she goes before Pesach, is it Asa? Loi Holcha, but if she doesn't go before Pesach, Loi, then she could have Ana, right? Then she could, then she could have Ana, right? In other words, guys, if you're like Rabbi Yehuda, she shouldn't be able to have Ana until after Sukkot. Why? Because maybe she'll go home Sukkot. She should be able to, she won't. Guys, you can't, look at me. You guys look at me. You can't sleep on, on Sunday lest you sleep on Monday. So you should not be able to have Anna from your husband. Why? Until uh, um, Pesach. You should be able to have Anna. Why? Because maybe you're going to go ahead and go to daddy to Sukkot. Yeah, we see over here, you could have Anna, right? Oh, Dafka before Pesach can't have Anna if she goes. But if she do it doesn't go to daddy before Pesach, you still can have Anna. But why? Guys, aren't you worried about the following? You'll have Anna, and then she'll go ahead and go home to daddy before Sukkot, and retroactively, you would have been over on Bal Yachel. So you see, you're not worried. I'm not worried about you sleeping. I'm not worried about you going to have enough from daddy. Kashan Reb Yehudu doesn't let you sleep. Like Reb Yehudu, you should not be able to have enough from daddy, because maybe you're going to be over to tonight. You can't sleep on Sunday. Maybe you'll sleep on Monday. You should not be able to have enough from your husband unless you go home to daddy. That's the Kashmir of Yehuda, because you could have enough from your husband. No, no, no. It's, that, that's, this is just a time. This is, again, this is, make, you can make a coinum. You can make a coinum. That's, that's a coinum. So now, uh, says the Gemara, Amar of Abba, Rav Abba answers, Holcha no. Holcha lefnei Pesach. If she goes before Pesach, Thus making it a full fledged, a full fledged neder asura veloike. I mean, some machloikas guys, who gets the malchus here? It's a big machloikas between the Ram, 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 the Ram. What? <laughs> she was over in the nether. He made it. <laughs> right. right. So, the, guys, if you do asura, asura veloika, or is asura veloike? Right? It, it depends. Who gets the malchus over here? This, the Ram brings down machloikas between Ram and Ram. Now, so here's the here's in other words here's Rabbi Yehuda is escaping, guys. Rabbi Yehuda is escaping. What does Rabbi Yehuda say? Hochel for Pesach. If she goes before Pesach, asura v'loika, right? She's awesome. Gets Malchus. Why? Once she went before Pesach, she engaged the Tanai. It's a full fledged neder. She's over on the neder. Malchus. Machlekasu. Loy holcha. Now let's say she didn't go before Pesach, and now the zman of the Tanai is over. The of the of the, of the Neder is over because the Neder is over to Pesach. Asura ba'alma. It's only Issa ba'alma, but it's Asa. Meaning, meaning you won't be able to do Hana. You, you know, it's, your diak is not a good diak. Dafka holcha is Asa, but not holcha is mutta. No, it's never mutta to have Hana. Why? You still have to worry about the Rabbanon. She may go after Pesach before Sukkot. She may fulfill it tonight, and then it'll be over the Rabbanon. But you can't. But no. So what's the teretz? Loy Rabbi Yehuda, you cannot have Hana. You can't have enough for your husband. Before Pesach, you can't have another Raisa, and, and afterwards, the Rabban. Aim is safer, that's the Peshat. Achara Pesach, right? If it's, it says, if, if the Achara ach, ach, Pesach, it says, if the Pesach, Vayachal Deborah. The, now, so she he made that, what's the Tanai? The Tanai is Yikina until after Pesach, and it's over Vayachal Deborah. No, to go home to daddy. The tonight is you can't go till after Pesach. The e the lo yisane lefnei a Pesach niyika bal yachel. If you shouldn't have a nub before Pesach, there's no bal yachel. El pshita yisane alma. What do you see on the base? Mishani v'tiyef the Reb Yehuda. You could have a nub. Doesn't work. Ki ketoni the yisane. Speaking where you did have a nub. So how is that bal yachel devaru? Okay, this, we escape the same way. Okay, tanan shat nenesli arachag. You cannot have enough for me until Sukkis. If you go what home to daddy till Pesach, okay. So again, the the you have the neder and then you have the tanai. Let's say she goes before Pesach, meaning she engaged the tanai. So the efah sura by nasi al chag umuteres le lachal chal Pesach. Holcha davka holcha when the tanai is fulfilled is asura loy holcha when it's not fulfilled loy. So the chayr it's shver amaravo who I did not feel the holcha sura. The same terrace we just gave before. So if, if the Tanai is fulfilled and before the, the time of the Ned is up, you go ahead 
the oven the nether the achel devaroi. But conversely, if the if the time of the nether is up and only be retroactive, then it's the rabbanon. Mesivet kikazu alai hayoyin im elech lemokim pliny. This kikar, this kikar, is also to me today. That's that's the nether guys. If I go to mokim pliny lemocha, so let's put it in our terms. Kika is sleeping on Sunday. If I go to the other place, it's sleeping on Monday. No, I want to keep on putting it back to Rabbi Yehuda because that's where the cash is going to be. Because right, but again, what does Rabbi Yehuda say? You can't sleep on Sunday unless you sleep on Monday. So over here, you should not be able to go ahead and have any enough from this kika unless you go ahead and go to this place on Monday. Achol, if you eat it, don't go, guys. If you sleep. Don't sleep. If you ate the kikar, don't go. But you can eat the kikar. Like Rabbi Yehuda, you should not be able to sleep. You should not be able to eat the kikar. Says the Gemara, enter the Gemara, Mikitani Eichel. Does it say Lush and Eichel, you could eat it? Achal Kitani, if it was eaten. The Chiachla. In other words, if it was eaten, that's if you fell asleep, you can't go. Right? If you went to daddy, you can't go. If you had to know, you can't go to daddy. So this is if it happened, but not that you could let it happen. Not that you can let it happen. You can't let this thing happen. You can't let this thing happen. Good? Very good. If he, if he, if he goes, it's he can't go. In other words, why can't he go guys, it says halach. If he goes, how is that? Why can't he go to Chatechila? It must be because he ate. If he didn't eat, what's to stop you from going? The, the tonight was what? The following. Tonight was, the tonight was I, I make a nether today not to eat this. If what? If I go tomorrow. It says, Halach, we went tomorrow. If he went. But Mahalach, he can't go tomorrow. Why can't you go tomorrow? Go tomorrow. It must be because you ate it. Hashem of Yehuda. You went to sleep, right? You can always go back to that. That makes it easier to go back. When you go back to Sushal to Rabbi Yehuda. It says, Bekash Lev Yehuda, Amalach Yehuda, who are then the listening Mahalach. Really, we should learn that what? He didn't eat. Mahalach, really, you should. Mahalach, Lechatchila, you can't go because he didn't eat. I did the Tani Reisha, Achal. Since the Reisha, you had to learn that he ate. Well, he missed the Eichel because you couldn't learn that Lechatchila you eat. Tana Seifa Halach. In other words, to be the syntax of the Brisa should be Achal and Halach. You learned the same, but in the it could be speaking mahalach lechatchila. You can go. Why can't you go lechatchila? Because you didn't eat on. You didn't eat the kika. Why didn't you eat the kika? Because you can't sleep. Same thing. Okay, just look at look at the Rashi over here. The, the Ran, excuse me. Uh, the Ran is parallel. Parallel. <laughs> you see what it says? The word Mishnah in the, in Rashi in the Mefirish parallel to that is the Ran. Now you think that Allah is like a Nechemia because we just bombed Rav Yehuda. Well, in Allah came on Rav Yehuda. We had been in the L. My eyes are koinim when I sleep tomorrow. When the whole shock of the of the Gemara was going according to Reb Yehuda, Shmami know that Allah is like a Yehuda. It's very interesting. And so that's the Allah that if you make a, a nether and contingent upon a Tanai, you won't be able to go ahead and engage, possibly engage in the nether, lest you chas v'shalom come to bal yachil by being over on the tonight, because you won't be so careful in keeping the tonight as you would in keeping the, the nether. Okay, what was the last thing of the Mishnah? The last thing of the Mishnah was that uh, the guy is making tashmish on his wife, Kainim. Okay, but that's what, it, and, and it's, it's mashal bal yachil so it works. We have a problem how exactly does this work? A man is meshubid to his wife. We're not talking about a mitzvah because the nether could be chal on a mitzvah. It's not speaking about the mitzvah of Aina. A man, is, in other words, it's not in his power to asa his, the tashmish. He can't asa, his wife owns him. He, his wife, she's Meshubid. He, she owns him vis a vis this halacha. So, so, how, if he's Meshubid to her, how could he go ahead and and how could he go ahead and, and why then? Okay, we, Rani is the good Kasha, and we saw this in, in uh, Mesech the Ksubis. There are certain things that can take off a shibud. Right? 
let's say you make your evan on a paitiki. You say the following. You know what? You're giving me a loan. I got this great evan. If I don't pay you back, he's collateral. He's yours. That slave is yours. You could say that, right? And guess what? You're not going to collect from any other slave. You're going to collect from him. You're going to collect from him. You're not going to collect from any other slave. You're going to collect from him. So you made the evan on a paitiki, a paitiki. You go ahead, you free the evan. How can you feed the Evid? That Evid is Meshubah to the guy. What's the answer? The Cheris is Mafkia Midei Shibud. Cheris takes off a Shibud. <coughs> you know what also takes off a Shibud? Let's say you said that Shar is not a Paitiki. You know, oh, you know what? I got this Pai Shar. You, you like that Shar, that bull? Guess what? It's yours. If I don't pay you off by X amount of day, it's yours. You go ahead and you make it into a carbon. What's the din? It's Hegdish. Why? Because Kainam, Hegdish is Magdish Midei Shibud. So over here also, you're saying Kainam. What's the Gemara's Kasha? What's the Gemara's Kasha over here? Koinim, it takes off his shibud. So even though he's Meshubah to his wife, but he, he said the Lashon of Koinim. So the Rani answer is that the Rabbanan went ahead and, and bolstered and, and supported his the Hashibud stronger that it doesn't take it off. But it's an interesting Kasha. And for the Gemara, it's speaking where Ba'imri said, Hanos Tashmishech Alai. The man says, The Hano of your Tashmish Zasra on me. In other words, I, I can't I can't make myself us on you, but I can make yourself us on me. And how do you know that? If the woman says to him, I'm, the, the benefit of my tashmish is is claiming to you, then he forced her and he's mishamish. Right? That his her she is mishuba to him. However, if he says the Hana, the Hana, your Tashmish is claiming on me, Asa, then it'll be Asa. Shame Achil no Yladim Dover Asa. You won't feed a person something that's Asa to him. So the case to the Mishnah, he says, he's saying your Tashmish, he doesn't say I'm Asa on you. He's making her Asa on him. That he could do, and that a person can't feed a Dover Asa. Thank you for coming. <laughs>